Hello, welcome to Megar's technical support video series, Frequently Asked Questions. In this video, we will review the hardware and main capabilities of the SPI 225. Let's get started. The SPI 225, which stands for Smart Primary Injection 225 Amps, is the smallest and lightest injection test system in its class. The output can reach up to 2,000 amps, offering features such as fully automated current regulation and DC offset and current decay elimination. The software includes thousands of low voltage circuit breaker time current curves. Let's review the hardware in detail. Starting from the right hand side panel, where we will find the mains connector as well as the power switch and the safety ground connector. Moving on to the front panel of the instrument. We have the Ethernet ports used to connect to either an STVI or a PC running PowerDB to control the unit. Next, we have the out Ethernet port used to connect to other SPI-225 in series or parallel to increase the output voltage or current. Next, we have the emergency stop button. And then the USB Type-B port, used as an alternative to the Ethernet port I previously mentioned to connect the instrument to a PC running PowerDB. Next, we have the indicators, both power, and output energized. Moving on to the connections to the test specimen, we first have the binary input, which can be used to monitor both dry and wet contents as an option to stop the timer in the software. And then let's look at the output connections. The unit has three tabs, starting in the front panel with the 25 amps tab at a maximum voltage of 70 volts. Moving on to the left hand side panel of the instrument, we have two high current tabs of SPI-225. As you can see, there is a common connector located in the bottom to use these two tabs. The first one, the 125 amps tab, can be used when the user connects both the common connector in the bottom and the rounded connector marked as 125 amps. This tab has a maximum voltage of 14 volts. Finally, we have the 500 amps tab at a maximum of 3.5 volts. It's important to highlight that all the tabs in the SPI-225 can be overloaded up to four times their nominal rating, which is the rating that is on the overlay of the unit. On this side panel, the instrument also incorporates an output energized indicator. Another very important highlight is to say that when connections to the specimens are made, the user will wire only one of the three tabs available. The main connections to the test specimen are summarized in the overlay located in the top panel of the instrument. This concludes SPI-225 hardware description. Visit the Mega YouTube channel for more videos including technical webinars, product overviews, and other how-to presentations similar to this one. Contact us for questions or more information about this topic, or for any support you may need for your electrical testing.